man, how much money do you want? I don't need money, man. Everybody got money. Yeah, man, look, it ain't that big of a deal. We just knock this out. Wham, bam. Thank you, man. Get I don't want to kiss day. you. But I know you're not gay, bro. That's not the point, okay? I don't want to kiss my friend for shoes. So what, you want to kiss a stranger? I don't understand what this I don't want to kiss anybody, Darius. <laughs> yeah, I'm mean, back. I'm going to need to ask the fellas. I got a line. You need to look at him again? Yo, this is wild. So some people on social media reacted to the scene and said, see, they say the LGBTQ community is pushing an agenda, but it's always straight people doing that gay shit on TV. So what's really going on? Said, it looks so made for TV. Ain't no passion in it, unfortunately. Then somebody said, have you seen the episode? It's not meant to be passionate. It's a dude making them do it for a pair of limited edition Nikes. The scene is fucking hilarious, man. I don't care how hilarious it is. I'm not watching no shit like that, bro. And that's my preference, like, I'm so tired of people saying, oh, if you can't watch two, two men kiss or two women kiss, that means that you're homophobic. No, how about that's just my preference. That's not what I want to see. You know what I'm saying? Some people don't want short people. Do that mean they racist against tall people? No, that's their goddamn preference. And I tried to give the show Atlanta a chance some years back, but I think it was season two when they started doing that racist shit a little bit on a couple episodes and I ain't even like that. So it, it ain't have nothing to do with no gay scenes or nothing. It was just some shit that I didn't like that. I didn't want to keep watching the show. But I know it's a huge show and it has millions of viewers. That's why they was renewed for a new season that started last month. So I heard it was a real good show. I'm just not a fan of it. But at the same time, a lot of people were just saying, why they always got to add gay shit on TV, like we understand the world is gay, but at the same time, the other side is saying, well, if it's so many gay people in the world, why we can't represent it on a screen? I mean, that's a point as well, but to my knowledge, Donna Glover and Lakeith Stanfield are straight men, to my knowledge. I don't know what the hell they do behind closed doors. And I know Lakeith Stanfield, he been dressing a little weird these past couple of years, so I don't even know if he's straight, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I don't care what you want to be with. You can want to only F broomsticks. I don't care. Do what you want to do. Long as you ain't broadcasting it, throwing it in my face. Hey, look at me. I'm gay. I don't care, bro, because what the next man do is not going to affect me at all. So I accept everybody, gay, straight, black, white, blue, green. I don't care. We all humans on this big ass rock called Earth. So do what you ever, whatever you wanna do, just do it. Just don't be broadcasting on all these shows. But at the end of the day, it's probably the network executives, the directors that wanna sprinkle the gay shit on stuff because that been a narrative in the past four or five years I've been saying that on every show, even my shows that I love the next season, some gay shit. So it's just the new normal that we gonna have to get used to and for the people that's complaining, hey, this is a new generation, bro. It's going to be out there on every, especially every new show that come out from now on. It's going to have at least one person on the show that's gay. Like, I, I can't even think of one show that I watch that don't be adding that shit in. It's just a new normal. And I'm not even hating on it. I just don't want to see a lot of it. That's why I don't watch shit like P-Valley, stuff like that. But once again, that's my preference. Everybody got their own, man. What y'all think about this? Be make sure to like, come subscribe. Mounts.